their video. The first thing I have is two in parallel. I'm going to have to solve those, and I'm going to have to solve it using the old formula. I can't, can't solve that an easy way, so I'm going to have to use the 30 times 6 divided by 30 plus 6. So 30 times 6 is 180, 30 plus 6 is 36, and if I divide 180 by 36, I should come out with 5. Correct? Yes. Victor says it's correct, right? Yeah, it's 5. Yeah. Oh, okay. Now that was a big step. Now, at this point, I need to treat that 5 as one resistor. At 5 ohms. That one resistor is in series with this one. So when they're in series, what do I do to them? Add them up. It's going to equal 12, right? Now that means C is going to get 12. And A and B. And A and B together are going to get 12. Correct? Yes. <laughs> 5 times 12 equals? 5 times 12 equals? That's A and B combined. Okay. But if A and B each got 60 volts, then both of these lines got 60 volts. Yes, sir. Right? If you guys had it that far, could you solve it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. 2 plus 10, sure enough, equals 12. Right? Sure enough, 120 and 600 equals 720. Mm -hmm. This one equals 720. Yeah, okay. Means this one has to equal 1440. 